what is going on guys and today we are taking a look at Uller's newest skin coming to Smite in patch 4.24 Frostfire Uller and as you can tell from that change it is the tier 5 skin now what's different about this skin is he doesn't have like four transformations like some gods do in their tier 5s he just has one but because he has a stance switch you still get four different skins he has his ice stance his fire stance and then his ice stance and fire stance again so it's pretty cool um it also comes with two separate voice packs one for his more human form and one for his element form i guess you want to say uh which is pretty cool the abilities are awesome i mean awesome he does all kinds of backflips and like twirls and all this stuff and it, we'll, we'll get into it in a little bit but it's pretty intense let's take a look at some of the vgs spotted. enemies behind us i'll attack left lane help middle lane right yourself retreat middle lane so you can see there we're gonna go ahead and jump into a jungle practice so we can look at um, right more lane. of the abilities and stuff like that I usually don't show this part, but for the sake of the player card, I'm actually going to. So you can see how it changes there a little bit. Uh, it, it, when it does last longer, the player card transforms into like another, like he transforms into his element form, but it just didn't take that long to load in, so that does kind of suck, but let's get, uh, we don't need to level an ult because we don't have an ult. <laughs> so uh, his basic attacks. Don't really change the sound or anything like that, um, but it's pretty cool. You can see um, how his magma arm is activated right now. Well, I can't really show you, but uh, and his ice arm is kind of cooled down. And then when you switch, it's the other way around. Now, the other cool thing, if you watch the cape, it slowly transforms from top to bottom, whether it catches on fire or cools out. And they distressed how long, like that took a long time uh, to like implement that. So it is a cool little feature. Basic attacks don't really do a whole lot there. Fire stance is a lot better, uh, just because the power of ice. fire effects are cooler. I mean, this will hurt. I can really go guide me. Yeah, that's pretty cool. That's the best part. His jump right there is without a doubt the best part. Let's do a little Uller combo real quick. Oh, well, that's not the stance we started. Really bad angle there, but you get the point. Uh, let's try the VGS while we're. Oh, there's a bug. Where's his axe? Let's test the other. I can really go either way. Stop at once. There it is. Okay, that's weird. A little bug there, but. <laughs> I have mastery over fire and ice. It appears you only have mastery over salt. <laughs> I actually like that one. Apologies for being new to this. I'm out of my element. Uh, that was corny. I have mastery over okay, fire. Okay, so that's and it. Ice. Let's see what it they look like on abilities or on adults. minions, I should say, the abilities. Real quick. If they ever spawn. There we go. So let's go ahead and go try to level up and uh, see what he looks like because it's it's really awesome. They they nailed it for sure. I think it's level ten. Yep, there we go. So you can't really see the front, which is unfortunate, but. I mean, you can see how cool it is. And ice. that's his ice stance. The transformation's really cool. No different jumps there. Oh, but he front flips in ice form. Even when he's in combat, so that's cool. See? See what I mean by he does, like, all sorts of flips? Uh, actually... Let's go check that out over time. Or actually, we gotta check this out. And then... I mean, it's nuts. They kill it. The skin's great. The voice pack's nice. The effects are nice. The skin's nice. But the best part... Oh, that's the wrong fountain. Is the animations, I think. Especially... Well, not especially. Only when he's in his uh, transformation. But you transform at level 10, and it doesn't... I mean, what's that? Like, 7-8 minutes in the game, maybe? It doesn't take that long, so... But yeah, when you use his one, he does a little back. Was it? Yeah, that's beat back up right there. 
And then when he throws this, he does a little twirl. And then when he jumps, another twirl. So, it, I mean, they kill him, honestly. Let's try a little Uller combo with this transformation. So you could just fly around and flip all through the air. Imagine just seeing this element change in man just flipping all in your face and stunning you and killing you instantly. It'd probably be... Honestly, I'd probably be okay with it. Because if I'm going to die... I want to... Wow, that wasn't on point. But uh, I'd want to die with that coming at me. So... Uh, the way to get, I don't think I mentioned it, but the way to get this skin is in the Odyssey. Unfortunately, that means you have to have bought pretty much everything up to this point in order to get the skin, which is a lot of gems, which is a lot of money. That's the only bad side, but it is a cool skin. If you have been doing the Odyssey, you get to look forward to this. Um, but yeah, we got to do VGS for this and then wrap it up. Oh, whoa, wrong, but I'm pretty good with a bow. My powers are just icing on the cake. Or if you prefer frosting. My pardons are just too cool. They really help me chill out. I'll snow myself out. These are so corny. I'm pretty good with a bow. Okay, so there's only two. I think he has different voice lines for his transformation as well. Frosting. Give a man a fire, yeah. and he'll be warm for an evening. Set a man on fire, and he'll be warm for the rest of his life. All right. I thought fire powers would be awesome. Then I started sweating lava. Yeah, the mistress doesn't like that very much. by ice. You so that is the skin, guys. If you enjoyed it, be sure to drop a like and hit subscribe for more content like this. Until next time. Peace.